on the road to Unforgiven, one week from Sunday, and for the first time since SummerSlam, the almighty Bobby Lashley is live and is in action. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Of course, the Raw exclusive event, Unforgiven, coming your way Sunday night, September the 17th at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. We're heading to the All-State Arena in Chicago, Illinois. And will the almighty Bobby Lashley be making his way to Unforgiven? That remains to be seen. But for the first time since SummerSlam, Lashley is back in action here on Monday Night Raw. Of course, Lashley coming up short in his pursuit of the WWE Championship. Just a few weeks back in Levi Stadium, that fatal four-way matchup along with Karrion Cross, John Cena, and Matt Riddle, which of course none of those four men ended up walking out of San Francisco with the WWE title. That was the man who cashed in his Money in the Bank briefcase in Seth freaking Rollins. We will see Rollins in your main event tonight against the Bruiser Weight Butch, but right now we're kicking things off on Raw with the almighty Bobby Lashley versus one of the superstars of tomorrow, a former NXT champion who has been making waves here on the red brand all summer long, Carmelo Hayes, one-on-one -on -one for the first time ever. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, Weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes! Well, as we just stated, Carmelo Hayes has been making waves on Monday Night Raw ever since he was recruited by Montel Vontavious Porter several months ago. We recently saw Trick Williams alongside Carmelo as well, and outside of one loss, Carmelo Hayes has been all but successful, or I should say all but failing here on Monday Night Raw. We have seen him in victories against Angelo Dawkins, Montez Ford, Rick Boogs, Madcap Moss. The only L in the column, if you will, of Carmelo Hayes came in the lead up to SummerSlam when he had a chance to become the number one contender for the Intercontinental Championship. He was defeated by Cedric Alexander. But tonight, Carmelo Hayes, dare I say, the biggest match of his main roster career just yet as he goes one-on-one -on -one with a former WWE Champion and the almighty Bobby Lashley. First time ever meeting to kick things off tonight in Newark. This is going to be a good one on the road to Unforgiven. A very interesting situation here as well as Bobby Lashley just at ringside as his former manager, Montel Vontavious Porter. And you remember all the way back this, this past January at the Elimination Chamber event, Bobby Lashley kicked MVP to the side after he was tired of MVP sticking his nose in his business. Lashley ordered him away from the ring. We didn't see MVP for months until he jumped ship to Monday Night Raw and brought Carmelo Hayes with him. A very interesting situation at hand tonight. But so far since the opening bell, the almighty Bobby Lashley out to make a statement and he's looking good so far. I'm sure after coming up short to win the WWE Championship at SummerSlam, Bobby Lashley is motivated as all hell to get the victory tonight. And the last time we saw Lashley in action here on Monday Night Raw it was three weeks ago in Las Vegas, Nevada, where he defeated the franchise player John Cena in an oh so epic main event. Gotta wonder what is next for Bobby Lashley, but also what is gonna be next for the superstar of tomorrow, a man who certainly has the it factor in Carmelo Hayes. And he takes Bobby Lashley out of ringside, sending him in to the barricade there. Carmelo Hayes, if he can get the upset victory tonight, that is certainly going to propel him to the next level here on Monday Night Raw. So far, starting to get back into this matchup, but will he be able to keep Bobby Lashley down for a three count at some point? But he certainly knows how to knock Bobby Lashley down. Beautiful float over DDT, but Bobby Lashley now ragdolling the opponent to the outside. Carmelo off the counter, and now Melo heading to the top, but nobody home. And the bigger, stronger Bobby Lashley coming from behind, muscling up a man who is a former NXT champion, former North American champion, former Cruiserweight champion, in Carmelo Hayes. Lashley just with a mean right 
right to the jawline of Carmelo. Lashley wants his hand raised in victory tonight, especially after that loss at SummerSlam. Lashley not looking to get come up short. Carmelo Hayes with different plans in mind. He sees the opportunity at hand tonight against the superstar, the caliber of Bobby Lashley. Future Hall of Famer, no doubt about it. And back and forth. This has been a slugfest since the opening bell. Both these men coming out swinging tonight as Melo goes back to the well with what works with that float over DDT. And now Lashley trying to create some distance. But it's Carmelo Hayes. Smart. He's going to stay on the offense here. Slingshot. DDT on the apron. Down goes Bobby Lashley in the opening moments of this matchup. Carmelo Hayes came to play tonight. Now looking to see this opportunity slip through his hands and a springboard crossbody to the outside. The agility of Carmelo Hayes, one of the best of them here on Monday Night Raw. Carmelo could be going for the countout victory here. Lashley down on the outside. Wait a minute, Carmelo Hayes has got his eyes locked in the almighty and takes things to the sky again. Carmelo understands the matter at hand. He knows it is not going to be an easy victory tonight if he can get the one up over Bobby Lashley, throwing everything at the almighty, seeing what sticks, and trying to keep Lashley down. And now back to the top rope. Melo not afraid to throw caution in the wind and a beautiful arm drag with a little bit of emphasis on it from the top. Bobby Lashley is stuck between a rock and a hard place right now. I don't know if he didn't expect this kind of energy, this kind of enthusiasm out of Carmelo Hayes, or if he's simply just caught off guard in this matchup. Obviously the numbers game not in Bobby Lashley's favor as well. Got to keep your eye on Trick Williams and MVP at ringside. But Bobby Lashley's got to shake the cobwebs off and he's got to get back into this match. Inside of the ring and Carmelo now on his tail. Melo double knees to the almighty. Into the cover. Oh, and wait a minute here. Melo. Melo's got the foot on the rope. Melo's got the foot on the rope. And he just stole the victory over Bobby Lashley. You have got to be kidding. Carmelo Hayes with the biggest win early on in the match of his Monday Night Raw career. But it's not coming without an asterisk. Here is your winner, Carmelo Hayes. Carmelo Hayes took Bobby Lashley off his guard, no doubt about it. But the feet on the ropes did not help Lashley's cause. In my eyes, Bobby Lashley just got screwed by a misstep by the referee and by the tactics of the superstar of tomorrow. The next time we come your way with a live premiere event, a special joint production of Monday Night Raw and Friday Night SmackDown. We are going international. Cardiff, Wales, Principality Stadium. It is WWE Clash at the Castle. And it is coming your way Sunday night, October the 22nd, live at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Don't miss this international extravaganza as Raw and SmackDown present Clash at the Castle. And we kick things off no bigger than the almighty Bobby Lashley. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. We want to thank you for joining us live tonight from the Allstate Arena in Chicago, Illinois. Last night was a super successful SmackDown Live No Mercy event from Baltimore. Thank you all for joining us last night as well. And this epic weekend concludes here tonight in Chicago with this Monday Night Raw exclusive Unforgiven festivities. And we kick things off, as we mentioned, no bigger, no better than the almighty Bobby Lashley, a man who in his mind has got a score to settle with the young upstart Carmelo Hayes. Hayes scored an upset over Lashley two weeks ago on Monday Night Raw, but had the feet on the ropes to leverage the pinfall and really sneak away with that victory over the Almighty. Lashley has not forgotten. And now that turmoil has spilled over to Chicago tonight 
And Lashley's looking for a little bit of retribution over a former NXT champion, former North American champion, former Cruiserweight champion, and a man who has been taking Monday Night Raw by storm with MVP and Trick Williams by his side. A man who's got that it factor, Carmelo Hayes. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. Well, Carmelo Hayes debuted a part of the Monday Night Raw brand several months ago and only has one loss on his record ever since his Monday Night Raw debut. And certainly the biggest win of his career on the red brand was that victory over Lashley two weeks ago with the feet on the ropes, as we mentioned. It's not that Carmelo Hayes didn't give Lashley a fight, because he absolutely did. But that little bit of leverage obviously could change the trajectory of a pinfall and certainly allowed Melo to walk away with the victory on that occasion. Carmelo Hayes, we've spoke about it to no ends. Absolutely going to be a future piece of the Monday Night Raw main event scene. But it's one, nights like tonight where you prove your status here on the red brand where you prove you got what it takes, where you prove you got what it takes to go to the next step in WWE. And that's what Carmelo Hayes needs to do. But I don't think Bobby Lashley is looking to allow Melo to make his name off the almighty behalf. Bell has sounded and we are underway here in the All-State Arena in Chicago. Thank you for joining us yet again tonight. Should be an incredible night of action featuring the WWE Championship on the line, the steel cage match between Brock Lesnar and Matt Riddle as well. Kicking things off with Carmelo Hayes and Bobby Lashley. We've hosted so many great events here in the All-State Arena in Chicago, Illinois. Yet another one tonight with this stacked Monday Night Raw live premiere occasion. Carmelo Hayes hot out of the gate all over the almighty Bobby Lashley. And that is really what aided him to even get the opportunity to get his feet on the ropes a couple of weeks ago. Was just keeping his foot on the gas pedal throughout the entire matchup. But Bobby Lashley... Did not come to play games tonight. Let's, uh, let's leave it at that, to say the least. Lashley, of course, is coming off a loss last month at SummerSlam in the main event for the WWE Championship. His return bout was against Carmelo Hayes. We all saw how that went. Lashley's got to be fired up tonight. Hungry to see his hand raised high here in Chicago. Off the scoop of the slam. And I think Lashley knows that Melo, a lot of talent, a lot of endurance. Wasn't going to put him away right there, but certainly he can get in the mindset of Mr. Melo don't miss. And obviously the X Factors at ringside, Trick Williams and MVP. And MVP definitely going to aid Carmelo Hayes in this matchup tonight. Knowing what Bobby Lashley is like, all fired up and focused as MVP at one time was standing alongside the Almighty. It was only last, or she should say earlier this year to the Elimination Chamber event. When Bobby Lashley kicked MVP to the curb, but all these months later, MVP now by the side of Carmelo Hayes and Bobby Lashley looking to outlast the numbers tonight here in Chicago. Melo rolling to the outside, trying to create some distance as the Almighty is fired up here in your opening match tonight at Unforgiven. Oh, wait a minute, Lashley taking things. Wait a minute, nope. Almost looked like Lashley was going to take things to the air. Not something that Lashley normally does, but when he got cold feet that time, realizing Carmelo's bell wasn't, wasn't completely wrong. Lashley's playing the smart game. You got to give him credit. Oh, wait a minute. Here's Lashley over the top rope, and that's exactly why Bobby Lashley hesitated the first time. Wasn't sure about Carmelo Hayes' whereabouts. And if Carmelo Hayes was just lying awake, waiting for Lashley to make a mistake. And that time it seemed to be. Lashley crashing and burning at ringside, and now Melo going to pick the bones. This could be a career-making performance for Carmelo Hayes tonight. It's one thing to get the victory on Raw a few weeks ago, but if he can do it once again tonight live at Unforgiven, Carmelo Hayes may be undeniable. Big-time DDT on the hardest part of the ring, and Hayes got to give him credit. Not backing down to Bobby Lashley, even though this fight has been taken to ringside. Got to give Melo his, his due. There's a reason MVP recruited him to come up from NXT and come to Monday Night Raw. Decorated champion down the black and gold brand. And certainly going to be a champion, like him or not, one day on Monday Night Raw. 
Referee's on a count of seven right now. Melo and Lashley better get back in the ring. Melo realizing, and Carmelo could be on the verge of a count out victory here. Count of eight. Lashley hustling towards the ring, and he gets it at the count of nine to save himself in this opening bout. Melo was looking, oh, wait a minute. Melo looking for the victory by hook or by crook, and even if that means MVP interfering. No love lost between Montel Vontavious Porter and the almighty Bobby Lashley, as we documented already here tonight. Melo hit, taking advantage of Bobby Lashley's back being turned. Now Carmelo trying to come from behind, but the almighty's got a lot in the tank. Now Lashley look, going for a gut wrench possibly here, but instead goes back with it in a big time fall away slam. Gut wrench style, very innovative by the almighty Bobby Lashley. Now we talked about the matchup with Melo a few weeks ago on Raw. The last time Lashley competed before that was last month at SummerSlam. But the last time Lashley scored a victory was on the last Monday Night Raw prior to SummerSlam in an epic main event collision against John Cena. Bobby Lashley hungry for victory tonight. And off the press slam, could see that three count. Not just yet as Melo gets the shoulder up. Great contest to kick things off so far. Wait a again. And I don't want to see this become a reoccurring theme of the matchup. MVP trying to get involved. But it may just be just that as Melo once again comes from behind taking advantage. Carmelo Hayes is out to make his name tonight off Bobby Lashley's behalf. Take the next step on the Monday Night Raw roster. Possibly put himself in line for championship opportunities. A lot could come with another victory over the almighty. Lashley knows that. And Lashley wants those same opportunities. But if this keeps up, Melo may be leaving Chicago, going two for two against the Almighty. Go for the cover here, that may be all she wrote. And not just yet, Bobby Lashley still with fuel left in the tank. Obviously the tiredness starting to set in, there's some of the athleticism out of Melo. Carmelo doesn't say Melo don't miss for a reason. You saw him land the target right there. Springboard, clothesline, Lashley off his feet. Now on the run to the outside, trying to catch a breather in here, but Melo not gonna allow it. Lashley is in dangerous territory right now. It only takes the referee's back being turned for a second for MVP or Trick Williams to try to get involved. Lashley back inside the ring and now Melo, very brave of this young superstar to go to the ground right there with Lashley who had very ma many times can be a brawler between the ropes. Melo Hayes has flipped the switch in this matchup ever since the last time MVP got involved which was about two minutes ago I'd say. Melo's been all over the almighty. They spoke too soon there. Wait a minute, counter by Lashley going for a possible dominator. No, Melo gets out of it. Lashley was looking for the dominator there. Nobody home, and Melo hits the neck breaker. Simple yet effective maneuver. Oh, wait a minute. Referee's back is turned. Referee's having a word with MVP and Trick Williams, and unintentionally, this is close to Melo the match. Oh, and only a two count there. MVP and Trick Williams' antics may have costed Melo as the referee was reprimanding him. But there's the double knees that Melo used to defeat Lashley two weeks ago. And he's not done just yet. Face first goes the Almighty. Melo, don't miss. Oh man, Lashley getting the shoulder up at 2.9. It is not over yet, ladies and gentlemen. This is how you kick off this Monday Night Roll exclusive live premiere event. All State Arena in Chicago is rocking and the Almighty is starting to get fired up. Melo throwing everything in the kitchen sink at this former decorated champion, this future Hall of Famer and Bobby Lashley. But Lashley is not done yet. Obviously a little bit slow paced right now after everything Melo inflicted on the Almighty. Lashley still laser focused on the objective at hand. Melo may be the one dazed and confused and Lashley with a big time slam down to the canvas. Melo's gonna need to see a chiropractor on Monday morning. Big time shoulder block, and now Lashley's just starting to play catch up right now. Melo inflicted a lot of punishment on the Almighty for a couple of minutes there. Lashley realizing he is behind in this match. And once again, the power on display. Nobody does it better than the Almighty Bobby Lashley, but 
Oh man, again, this time it's Trick Williams. Referee's back is turned as he's focused on Mello, possibly about to count him out here. Bobby Lashley cannot allow Trick Williams and MVP to dictate the pace of this match. Which is what is happening right now. Could have easily been on the offense against Carmelo Hayes and it happens again. Lashley goes to the sky and he might have hit that a few seconds ago if it weren't for the distraction by Trick Williams. The numbers game is not in Bobby Lashley's favor tonight. And it is certainly benefiting his opponent. Melo don't miss. And now on the outside. Not gonna go well for Bobby Lashley. That is two costly missteps by Lashley in this match. And that's not counting the other times that his back was turned and Melo took advantage, but I think Bobby Lashley's starting to come a little unhinged, just sending Melo right into the steel steps. Meanwhile, as we're talking about it, there's Trick Williams again. This is absolutely ridiculous. So we gotta get Trick Williams and MVP away from ringside to have an even fight between Mello and Lashley. Because I got a feeling the pace of this contest would have been a hell of a lot different thus far had they not been involved. Expect nothing less from those three on the right. Nonetheless, Bobby Lashley is down. Bobby Lashley may be out, and Carmelo Hayes is trying to pick the bones of the Almighty, but the Almighty's got too much left in the tank. Dominator! He was looking for it earlier, but this time it connects. And it's not enough. It's not enough as Melo gets the shoulder off the canvas, but Bobby Lashley certainly changing the pace of this contest. Big time dominator by Lashley to take down Mello. Wasn't enough for the three count, but certainly gonna inflict some punishment. And there's a spear from the middle rope. You wanna talk about changing the trajectory. Mello's ribs gotta be crying for mercy right now. And if they're not already, there's Lashley to inflict some added punishment. Another spear. Bobby Lashley picks up a much needed victory to kick things off here at Unforgiven. Well, the numbers game was almost a detriment to the almighty Bobby Lashley, and a handful of mistakes almost came back to haunt him. But in the end, Lashley just wanted it more. He stayed the course, he stayed focused, and he pulled out his big time maneuvers to get the victory. Here is your winner, the almighty Bobby Lashley. That was a much needed victory for Bobby Lashley after two consecutive losses and certainly some shocking ones at that. What a way to kick things off tonight in the All-State Arena. Whether I don't want to do it or not, I guess we got to give some credit to Carmelo Hayes for giving the fight to Lashley, but in the end, only one man could leave Chicago the victor, and that is the almighty Bobby Lashley. The next time we come your way with a live premiere event, a special joint production of Monday Night Raw and Friday Night SmackDown. We are going international. Cardiff, Wales, Principality Stadium. It is WWE Clash at the Castle. And it is coming your way Sunday night, October the 22nd, live at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Don't miss this international extravaganza as Raw and SmackDown present Clash at the Castle. We are live tonight in Jacksonville, and it is main event time here on Monday Night Raw! The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, the almighty Bobby Let's take a look back about six weeks ago here on Monday Night Raw. Lashley 101 for the first time ever against Carmelo Hayes. And Hayes giving the Almighty a run for his money on that night. But you see the double knees and then the story here was Melo using the feet on the ropes to gain the leverage and stealing a victory over the Almighty Bobby Lashley on that night. That is a loss that did not sit well with Bobby Lashley and he certainly came back for more with Lashley. Less than two weeks ahead before his match with the beast incarnate Brock Lesnar in Cardiff, Wales. What is going through the mind of Lashley? 
Carmelo Hayes tonight. A shot at the WWE title hanging in the balance in Cardiff. Lashley's got a busy schedule. Looking to keep up here tonight in Jacksonville. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. And it was last month at Unforgiven in Chicago, the rematch between Melo and Lashley, where Bobby Lashley once again was pushed to his absolute limits but certainly dished it right back to Carmelo Hayes. A spear that cut Melo in half in the middle of Allstate Arena, and that was a scored victory for Bobby Lashley. So if you're keeping score, that's one for Carmelo Hayes, one for the almighty Bobby Lashley. We need the rubber match. Again, it's supposed to be a six-man tag team match here tonight. Melo, Trick, and MVP taking on Lashley and the Street Profits. Unfortunately, an injury coming to light to Trick Williams that he suffered two weeks ago here on the season premiere of Raw against Bobby Lashley. Trick unable to compete. Let's settle the score the old fashioned way. MVP barred from ringside, no Street Profits, no Trick. Mello, Lashley, one on one. Settle the score live here on Raw. Should be a great matchup and you know this feud between Mello and Lashley has really started to be a coming out party for Carmelo, he Carmelo Hayes excuse me, here on Monday Night Raw. Can he keep that going tonight in Jacksonville? Bobby Lashley has got other plans, however. My goodness. Tonight is an opportunity to not only keep the momentum strong for Lashley, but to send a message to the beast incarnate Brock Lesnar. As Mello looking for the early victory, but I think he knows it's going to take a little more than that. Mello just trying to get into the psyche of Bobby Lashley. There's one thing Mello needs to learn throughout these contests is that you never turn your back on somebody with the size, strength, and veteran status as Bobby Lashley. Especially Lashley less than two weeks until he fights Brock Lesnar at Cardiff, Wales. A matchup that will determine a future challenger for the WWE Championship. Bobby Lashley is a man who has been seeking championship gold for months here on Raw. You remember he competed for the WWE title back in the main event of SummerSlam, the fatal four-way matchup. Came up short on that night, Lashley with another leash on life, if you will, a week from Sunday at Clash at the Castle. Mello rolling to the outside. That was an, an emphatic Irish whip by Lashley into the buckle. Lashley diving over the top rope. Caution in the wind, but it works out for the Almighty this time. And you, know, you remember back to anybody who saw the unforgiving contest between Lashley and Carmelo Hayes. Lashley went for that same dive on numerous occasions throughout the matchup, and it did not work out for Bobby Lashley. So Lashley really playing with the, the chance that Melo was going to have that scouted there, decided to throw caution in the wind anyway, and at least worked out from this time for Carmelo Hayes. Not looking to allow Lashley to take advantage of that started momentum. Melo's got all the tools to be a future main event player here on Monday Night Raw. One of the breakout stars of NXT in recent years. Former NXT champion, North American champion, cruiserweight champion. Came up to the Monday Night Raw back in, back in May by hands of Montel Vontavious Porter. And now Melo all on his own tonight. Going one-on-one -on -one with Bobby Lashley. Imagine the win it could be for Carmelo Hayes, especially with what is ahead for Bobby Lashley. It's the main event of Monday Night Raw. You defeat the Almighty right here tonight. A man who's going to fight Brock Lesnar in less than two weeks at Clash at the Castle. I mean, what that could do for Carmelo Hayes' career only remains to be seen. But first, Melo's got to get the job done, and he's got to do it. And certainly a statement-making way tonight, to say the least. I don't want to see any feet on the ropes by Melo tonight. Knocking Lashley off the apron. Mello don't miss, and certainly that time he didn't. Lashley feeling the brunt of it. And now Mello this time over the top rope. Somersault plancha down to the ground, and Lashley down and out momentarily. Oh, and Mello keeping it going. Little short order super kick on the outside. Mello Hayes is out to make some noise on the red brand. Sending Bobby Lashley back inside the squared circle. And you got to wonder 
where Lashley's psyche is at so close to that matchup with Brock Lesnar. Is he looking through Carmelo Hayes tonight? Because if he does, Carmelo Hayes may have a window of opportunity to take advantage of. Dropping the elbow to the heart. But Lashley says not just yet. Lashley with a lot of energy behind that kick out. These two with two matches already behind them. They know each other pretty well at this point. Who's going to get the better of the two in this matchup tonight? Wait a minute, Lashley. Little roll up here. I'm going to steal the victory on Melo. Watch your back, Carmelo Hayes, but there's Carmelo turning things around with the double knees to the jaw, and he's not done just yet. Melo ain't going for an alley-oop. He's going for a slam dunk off the top of the leg. Melo don't miss into the cover. Oh, almost had him there. Almost had him. Close call. Carmelo Hayes with the double knees, dropping the leg from the heavens. But well, Bobby Lashley's heart is still pumping. And Mello now trying to kick into a new gear. Unleash a different side of Mello. And try to give Bobby Lashley maybe something unexpected. Something to throw him off his game. And something to ultimately score the three count. And Mello is playing with fire right there. Taking things to the ground with Lashley. Inevitably not working out for him. And Lashley mid rump spear. The trajectory has got to kill the ribs of his opponent. And Lashley going to keep it going. The powerhouse looking to turn things around after that close call a few moments ago. Now it's Carmelo Hayes on the run, if you will. And Lashley on the top. Oh, man. Massive hangman's neck breaker from the top into the cover. And Carmelo Hayes, enough wherewithal to get the shoulder up and the matchup continues here on Monday Night Raw. Melo's first ever main event here on the red brand. And certainly all eyes are on this young star tonight. Will he thrive under pressure? Or will he be a stepping stone for Bobby Lashley's road to clash at the castle? Superplexed by the almighty. Jacksonville, Florida coming unglued. And Lashley is looking to wrap things up here. Dominator on Mello. Into the cover. Oh, but Carmelo Hayes still in it. Shoulder off the canvas. Mello survives momentarily. Man, physical main event on hand inside the Veterans Memorial here on Monday Night Raw. Lashley and Mello tearing down the house. But who is going to get the three count? Who is going to be the better man? They've each scored a pinfall over the other in the past. And wait a minute. Carmelo Hayes. I think he's looking for the hurt lock. I don't know how well he's got it in. But he's trying to use Lashley's own submission hold against the Almighty. Lashley is struggling a little bit. I don't know how well Carmelo's got the submission in here. Oh, but the big, the big arms of Lashley. The strength of the Almighty to muscle out of it. Bobby Lashley reminding Carmelo Hayes not to bring a knife to a gunfight. Don't try to use the hurt lock against the man who does it best. Melo into the quick cover. Not just yet, Lashley kicks out again. Bobby Lashley may have survived, but is certainly damaged. And Melo better take advantage. This is the naiveness of Carmelo Hayes playing a factor. Oh, Bobby Lashley holds on to the top. Melo might have missed that time. And now here's the strength once again on display in the middle of the Veterans Memorial. There's a few times throughout this matchup that Carmelo Hayes unintentionally allowed Lashley to get back into it. Took his eye off the ball. And that is where the veteran status of Bobby Lashley and the naiveness of Carmelo Hayes really shows itself in those moments in this main event contest. Mello on the outside right now, just trying to get his wherewithal, but Bobby Lashley coming off the apron, tossing in the win, all in the means of victory tonight. Mello would have thrown his best shot in this contest. After Bobby Lashley turned the tides a few moments ago, the Almighty seems to be kicking it into a new gear. Mello's down, Mello may be out. 
We may be nearing a conclusion here tonight in Jacksonville. Oh, and right in the barricade. It's been a great night of action here. Second to last Monday Night Raw before we get to Cardiff, Wales. Remember, next week, we're live from Atlanta, Georgia with that Champions versus Challengers tag team main event. Sheamus, Tyler Bate going 2v2 against the Intercontinental Champion, LA Knight, and the WWE Champion, Seth freaking Rollins. Coming your way next week. As Bobby Lashley was looking for the elbow off the apron, nobody home, and Lashley might have just handed the momentum on a silver platter to Carmelo Hayes. Both men go for shots there, and Melo gets the best of it. Carmelo Hayes might have just found a window of opportunity to take advantage of, but will he be able to score the pinfall? Some great strength there showed by this young superstar. Melo Hayes, people have said he's got the it factor. He's going to be one of the main event players of Monday Night Raw for years to come. It could all start here tonight with a main event win over Lashley. And look at Melo showing some strength of the big time. STO down to the canvas. Excuse me, Uranagi. Lashley's down. Lashley's hurt. As this matchup progresses, we're really starting to enter some deep waters here in this rubber match between Lashley and Melo. And Carmelo Hayes, you see, may just be throwing anything he's got at Lashley right now, but a little Asai moonsault off the middle buckle into the cover. But Bobby Lashley still is in this fight. Carmelo Hayes thought he had him. Taking things to the sky, and Melo may be looking to do so again. Maybe looking for that slam dunk. Off the top. No, a counter by Lashley. Went to the well too many times with that leg drop. Lashley countered with the power bomb, and now the STO by the Almighty. Bobby Lashley with a last ditch effort might have saved his chances at victory here tonight in Jacksonville. Oh, and now Lashley in the corner, looking to repeat Unforgiven, looking for the same result. A spear on Carmelo Hayes, dead center of the ring. And Lashley with the win. Well, Carmelo Hayes throughout this series of matches with the Almighty, pushing Lashley to his limit in a coming out party for a superstar that is certainly here to stay on Monday Night Raw. But in the end, Lashley, all too motivated and focused on Clash at the Castle. Here is your winner, the almighty Bobby Lashley. A victory for Lashley tonight. But will it be the same result a week from Sunday? Or are we looking at the next number one contender for the WWE Championship? October the 22nd, live from Principality Stadium, Brock Lesnar, Bobby Lashley, for the number one contendership to the W. Wait a minute. Bobby Lashley may be getting an early preview of Principality Stadium in Cardiff, Wales. The Beast, Brock Lesnar. For the first time since Chicago and Unforgiven, Lesnar has made the trip to Jacksonville, Florida. And Brock Lesnar is looking to get an up close and personal look at the man he meets in Principality Stadium a week from Sunday. The country A is kicking alpha male of our species. Brock Lesnar is back on Monday Night Raw. A Lesnar in the ring. Oh, these two men squaring off with each other. And Bobby Lashley not looking to be a stepping stone for Brock Lesnar's road to clash at the castle. And we have got a fight on our hands in the middle of the Veterans Memorial as Lesnar with Lashley on his shoulders. And at five by Lesnar. Brock Lesnar came to send a message to the man he meets in Cardiff. One at five may not have been enough. Lesnar's going for the dose. And the Almighty feels the wrath of the beast incarnate. Oh my goodness. And now Lesnar going for the hat trick. 
A third at five. Brock Lesnar throwing down the gauntlet. Lesnar giving Lashley an early preview of what is to come in Principality Stadium at Cardiff, Wales, a week from Sunday when these two alpha males meet at Clash at the Castle. One week from tonight is the final Monday Night Raw before our trip to Cardiff in Atlanta. We'll see you next week. Thank you, and good night, everybody, from Jacksonville. On when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, doing me no cap. I'm a